Manny O. Mitchell is a local track star. He grew up in Shelby and graduated from Crest High School. He began running track when he was in high school and gained an athletic scholarship to attend Western Carolina University. Manny O. practiced and trained hard to run fast and endure in races. After lots of training, Mitchell qualified for the 2012 Olympics in London, England. He competed in an event called the 4x400. This is a team relay event where four runners take turns running a leg or portion of the distance. Each relay member runs 400 meters, one lap of the track. The team who finishes the relay in the shortest amount of time wins. In the Olympics, the team who wins finishes the relay fastest and they win a gold medal. The second fastest team wins a silver medal and the third fastest team wins a bronze medal. Manio and his teammates practiced extremely hard for this event, running the distance over and over again and finding ways to make their times faster. When it came time to run the relay, the team gave it their all and came in second place after receiving the silver medal. You may be wondering why I'm telling you this and what it has to do with decimals. When you time races, it's very important to have the exact time of each person. For those of you have, who have ever been the judge of a race at recess, I'm sure you've experienced the difficulty of trying to determine who tags your hand first. To be sure of who wins and to be fair, track officials or race judges use a stopwatch to time runners and record their times. A stopwatch can time minutes, seconds, and even tenths and hundredths of a second. I'm going to show you some of Manio's race times for running 200 meters. 200 meters is half of the track. His times for running 200 meters are 20 and 47 hundredths seconds, 20 and 78 hundredths of seconds, 20 and 17 hundredths seconds, and 20 and 9 tenths seconds. Can you order these race times from least to greatest?